Hi everyone, it's Lucinda at the Bee's Knees. I'm here getting all ready for summer with my Victoria Eggs Nicely nauti um, Nautical apron on. And as the weather's getting warmer, there'll be more outside eating, picnics, barbecues. Um, and my son's home from college and eating is out of house and at home, so I thought it was time to make some sausage rolls. And whenever we post sausage rolls or pictures, everybody wants to know how to make them and they are truly the easiest thing in the world to make and the most delicious snack. So I'm going to show you today how easy it is to make English sausage rolls. So I'm going to use the, um, the sausage meat from our local farm stand, which is a nice quality one, but as I say, Jimmy Dean is readily available in most grocery stores and it works just fine. I've used that as well. So basically you can add sage and onion to it. Delia Smith has that in her recipe, but you don't even, they're that simple that you don't even need to go, go that fancy. So you do it like this and fill each um, piece of pastry, the sheet that we've cut into three. You just roll it into sausages. Uh -huh. And um, so you can add seasoning if you want to. And then I'm going to take, I've got some water in this cup and I'm going to just seal the edge with a little bit of water and roll this over and seal the edge. You might have to stretch it just a little bit and then push it down so that it doesn't pop open in the oven. And now you're going to cut them into however big you like. We like them kind of bite size. Lots of sausage meat like that. And then I'm going to put little cuts with scissors in the top to let some of the steam escape while they're cooking. Like that. And then I'm going to put them on a baking tray like this. And it's good to have one with a lip because they do um, release some fat when they're cooking and then it, um, it kind of saves it and the, the parchment can soak it up. So I'm going to repeat that with the other two, two sheets of paper. So I'll just do that and then we'll finish them off. So I finished with the other two strips of um, the pastry and it took me literally about five minutes to get them like this. So as I said, you need some sausage meat. I use the Bort Pepperidge Farm Puff Pastry. It really comes out great. If you want to add some seasoning, you can. And now I'm just going to crack an egg into a mug and find my fork, which is there. <laughs> just give this a, a whisk up. And I'm going to um, just glaze the top of the um, sausage rolls with the egg so that they come out nice and crispy and shiny when they've been in the oven. So as you can see, it really is the easiest thing to do for a summer barbecue. They will get devoured. We often make them as appetizers and literally sausage rolls are just nearly always one of the first things to get eaten at a party or an event, book group, <laughs> anything like that. And you can even um, freeze them. You can freeze them at this stage without the egg wash and then cook them. Or you can freeze them when they're cooked and then just warm them up in the oven when they've been defrosted. Not quite as good as the fresh thing, but um, if you're cooking for a crowd or want to be prepared, that's a good way to go too. So we're nearly done and then into the oven. They will go. So they're all ready. That was it. I think it took about 50 in the oven. It really didn't take long. You've got a snack from a few people there. My kids are going to be very happy. So we're putting it near the top of an oven, 425, and keep an eye on them at about 10 minutes. They really don't take that long to cook. So I'm going to put the timer on for 10 minutes and then we'll check them. So they've actually been in 15 minutes. I checked on them after 10 and um, I did another five minutes and there they are, crispy, golden, sizzling, delicious looking sausage rolls. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna bring them over to the, the cooktop, close the oven door, and then put them on a, a rack to cool. And there they are, delicious looking sausage rolls. So there they are, the beautiful finished sausage rolls, nice crisp from the egg, glaze and shiny, lovely cup of tea. 
think we better try one. They're not going to last long in this house the way my two kids are going to eat them. Make some sausage rolls, they're the easiest thing and so delicious. Thanks for watching.